Hello Aquarius, welcome to your horoscope. Okay, so this is a time for you to um, build up. Build up your ability to take risks. You've gone through a lot of transformation in the past several weeks. And I mean, this weekend's gonna be a good party weekend for you. You're gonna feel good. You're gonna have good people around you. It feels really good. But as we go further and further into the week, actually, Moon is going to be in Aquarius on a Wednesday morning, right when the Sun goes into Libra. So it's kind of like, like air on air, and, and the Moon and Sun trine each other at 11.34. So it starts out really nice and positive and kind of light, lighthearted. And so there's a sort of spirit of cooperation of groups. And we want to bring justice. And, you know, I hear that there, you know, <clears throat> there seems to be some kind of debate in the Democratic Party about, you know, who should be leading the country and be POTUS and all that stuff. And um, I have to admit, if you're, if you're basing it on who's related to the Queen and who is going to be more willing to sell out for Monsanto and other corporate douchebags, then that's shame on you. Shame on you and shame on your lack of commitment to elevating the people of this country. I, I, I just find that despicable. And in some ways, you know, I, I've heard it said that, you know, I, I, that this one particular person, sometimes referred to as a witch of Wall Street or the matriarch of Monsanto, um, you got to be really careful. You know, we have a, a horrible history of playing second best, and it seems like there's this really cool Jewish civil rights activist. It's like packing out auditoriums everywhere and it's calling the, the corporate welfare on its BS. We need to support this guy, you know. That's it, you know. We need to be lion-hearted and back him up because this is no time for hanky-panky with privileged punks running the country anymore. It's not working for us, you know. It's not working for the common person. It's not working at ground level. And ultimately, even for most of the rich people, it's not going to work for them as well either. So I say happy, happy. And, you're, and Aquarius, I just call on you because you're radical enough to put the man to task. As <laughs> we're in justice time, you know, you're going to be getting into your heart, you know, and your heart chakra for Aquarius is you got to move forward with this stuff. Now with Venus and Mars and Leo, you're going to make good relationships. You're going to, you're going to have this dynamic appeal. And with Jupiter transiting your eighth house, you're going to have other people help you. So I think it's time to run with this. And it's time not to give up. And it's time not to settle for second best. Because, um, you know, that's the way it's always been done. You know what? what how it's always been done is because Hurricane Katrina, the war in Iraq, 9-11. That's because all that, it's always been done that way kind of mentality. So stop that. Stop all that crap, you know. It's time to think positive, And it's time to support people that are trying to do something good. Instead of those who just want to, you know, pretend and nod and wink while they, you know, 